Mumbai City nil Al Shabab 3 Definitely not the start that I wanted to see Mumbai City get into uh, coming in the first uh, Champions League game, the Asian Champions League, and we played well. I would like to say till the dying moments because after that we went complete. You know, we we were bad after that. Okay, and I can understand this from point of view. We are playing in a place which is hotter mostly, and so stamina is going to be a huge issue. Plus. each team is going to be playing a game every 3 days so that is almost like a huge level of pain that our team is going to suffer let's talk about our players specifically i am not going to talk about al shabab because i think we know first we'll talk with the goalkeeper puiba lenchempa started in uh, instead of uh, nawaz okay and to be honest he was quite decent most about times with some amazing saves according to me uh, but gave away that one silly penalty according to me but uh, overall he was quite good yeah made a huge issues here and there but overall i feel puiba lenchempa was actually decent enough if you just remove that penalty thing he was quite good uh, considering a uh, against a team like al shabab uh, he kept quite good amount of saves and quite uh, you know at point blank he also saved one so i'm kind of happy with his performance now we talk about the uh, wingers manda wasn't that good okay let's be, let's be honest he started on well mumbai city put him in the starting 11 because at this point at this game you want experience and manda has to offer that but alas i don't think he played uh, very well and according to me um, quite a forgettable uh, performance unless that one cross which mistakenly went in the goal means you know, the goalkeeper had to save if that had gone for a goal he would have been an absolute legend but otherwise um, crosses were not that decent enough you know and um, I'm uh, talking about Rahul Beke. He was solid at the right back position. Didn't uh, do too much of mistakes, but didn't do too much of good things also. So he's like kind of a neutral guy. Mutada Fall, Mehtab Singh uh, were great in their centre back roles. Uh, good uh, tackles, passing, and all. Of course, they ended up conceding another two goals. But uh, overall, I feel like you can't do. How much can you save? Because they were uh, what is that called? Uh, Al Shabab were continuously attacking, and Mumbai were continuously. defending so uh, you cannot expect much okay uh, aupuya was kind of decent according to me aupuya jahu uh, i'll talk about jahu later but aupuya uh, considering he's just 21 i think less than 21 and this is his first uh, international tournament he was quite playing quite well and according to me it he had a very good performance so a uh, great job by him overall yes could have been little more better but uh, first game I, i can just leave it out for them uh, i am a jahu uh, i have some issues with him here uh, lost the ball many times did some bad passing considering he's one of that player who we need the playmaker player the person with the passing and all so he's uh, had quite some forgettable moments and hopefully improve from that coming back from injury that's there bipin chande were amazing by the wing uh, except for the crossing part I think the absence of a striker a main striker proper striker was the big issue for Mumbai City that day with uh, Angula out injured and I think uh, with Angula Diego Maicho had some administrative issue something wrong with his name and certificate I don't know what that means but uh, he had to be removed out also so Mumbai were basically playing with only three foreigners and Brad Inman is also I think out injured or something How can you do that? That is why I wanted Mumbai to sign another Asian player because we were playing with just three foreigners instead of the three plus one because the plus one the Asian quota player Brad Inman was not available. Yes, that's a disgrace overall. But uh, apart from him, okay, uh, let's talk. Vikram uh, did some amazing runs. He was basically, you know, he and. Uh, Casio Gabriel were bus interchanging and all so basically they didn't have to do much but I would like if they had some shots on target okay uh, Vikram didn't have much even uh, Casio Gabriel uh, got the ball in front many times did some good crosses here and there but uh, you know the end the finishing our team lacked finishing uh, and it's certain without a striker our team always lacked so overall I would say that 
you know this team uh, needs more improvement uh, talking about substitutes wise guiki wat was i think good okay guiki wat was playing well when he came as a sub vinith rai didn't have much to do but overall rainier fernandes was quite sloppy he was slipping down so many times i think the second goal uh, fell because of his miss pass also so i'm kind of skeptical about him but overall i think we can improve in the next two days i think we play air for sevak uh, so that's going to be a big game we are down by three goals so our goal difference has to also improve so uh, if we uh, get a positive result that is a win against uh, air for sevak i think it will be a good performance for us tell me your thoughts guys in the comments down below what you feel about this uh, overall i'm not that uh, sad because i expected us to lose but the fact that we just lost 3 nil itself is i kind of kind of decent so that's great guys tell me what your thoughts are about mumbai city's match in the comments down below thank you for watching this video do like share subscribe see you all in more videos coming soon in the near future goodbye take care stay safe